For, well, while most people love Halloween, many animals are just downright terrified by all the commotion. In addition to being scary, Halloween can be dangerous to our pets. Dr. Ruth, the pet vet, joins us now to talk about some of the common Halloween hazards and ways to keep pets safe this Halloween. Thank you so much for joining us. Love your setup. We want to start <laughs> right with your cutie little pet there and what to do if your pets get into any of that candy that people might be bringing home. Well, thanks for having me. Yeah, this is Jet and he's dressed as Frankenstein. Um, the first thing people really need to do is keep their pets inside. Every year, many pets get lost when they dart out an open door or they escape from a backyard. Um, pets are scared of all the creepy noises, so the best thing to do is really keep them inside in a back room away from all the commotion. I recommend turning on the TV or a radio to keep them distracted. You want to give them a toy or a treat. I've got a bunch from West Paw. We make a variety of different treat toys, which enable you to actually put treats or um, their food inside the toys to keep them busy. Um, they even have a cookbook of all different things you can do to put inside these toys. But the name of the game is to keep your pet busy. You want them busy and distracted so that they're not stressed by all the creepy sounds going on outside. So you wouldn't recommend putting them away in a quiet room somewhere? Yes, definitely. You want them in a back room away from all the commotion. But while they're in that room, they need something to do, and that's where having treats and toys to keep them busy is really key. The second thing that you really want people to do is to make sure they're mindful of candy. We want to make sure that our pets can't get in to any candy. Most people know that chocolate is toxic to pets, but a lot of people don't realize that it's not just chocolate. We have to watch out for any candy that may have the sugar substitute xylitol in it. This can be in gum or sugar-free candies. You also want to watch out for candy that contains raisins. Raisins and grapes are toxic to dogs. So if you have any kind of chocolate candies with raisins, again, watch out for those. The best thing to do is put the Halloween candy safely out of reach of curious paws. All right, Dr. Ruth, the pet vet, thank you so much for joining us this morning. We really appreciate it. Sorry about that background noise, too. You did a great job. Thank you for all the oh, wonderful okay. tips. You. We really appreciate it. And you can catch this segment. We're going to try to post it up on our website. So stick around for that if you want to refresh your memory on some of those tips.